What's up everybody and welcome to a brand new series on the channel called Score Peak. In this series we will go over the best scores that happen throughout the week and through the voting system in my discord server you will decide the order of the scores. By the way links to my server is in the description and if you want more benefits in the discord server be sure to become a youtube member. Speaking of which shout out to all my youtube members. Alright let's start with some honorable mentions that unfortunately didn't make the list. In the number 13 spot we have Utami's choke on Imperial Circus's Shin Batsu. On the number 12 spot we have Chikoni's DTFC on World's End with 99.14% accuracy. And the final honorable mention is Emrex's hidden DTFC on Dark Flight Dreamer that is worth 1009 PP. Alright, let's start with the actual list. On the number 10 spot we have Spares' FC on Everything Will Freeze. Spare is a pretty controversial figure in the OSA community but we're not going to talk about that. The score that he set this week is actually pretty insane considering he only got 3 100s to Throughout the whole map, if seen it with 99.87% accuracy, and of course, getting the number 8 spot on the map, earning himself 779 pp in the process. On the number 9 spot we have a secret boxes 3 miss choke on Astral Empire. Pretty crazy map, we've seen a few weeks ago that Maliszewski almost got an FC on it with Hidden, but unfortunately he did indeed break. However, a secret box did manage to get 3 misses on the map which is pretty crazy and the play is worth 920 pp. At the number 8 spot we have one of my favorite maps which is Coco Soko and it got FC this week with Hidden by Zootinator. This map is extremely difficult to aim as you will see in the replay. The fact that Zootinator managed to FC this with Hidden and on top of that she held 99.40% accuracy. Absolutely crazy play and a well deserved number 1 spot on the map. Okay, so for the number 7 and 6 spot in the votings, we got a tie, which means that these plays got equal votes. So realistically, the order doesn't really matter. So I'm just going to start with Emrex's score first, which is his 4 miss run with 3 mod on cycle hit. And this score is absolutely crazy, would I even say insanity, because this is what the 3 mod leaderboards on the map look like. I mean, do we really need to say more about Emrex? Like, he is already one of the best, if not the best player ever in Osu, showing it again with this score.
player by the name of Bunny Lake Money managed to FC Painters with Hard Rock getting the number one spot on the map and he FC it with 98.78% accuracy. Considering the fact that most top players struggle with FCing this map, it's actually crazy. I mean, a legend like Itki himself didn't manage to FC this with Hard Rock, so like, yeah, just have a look. Alright, so on the number 5 spot, we have another surprise score from a player by the name of Lesperi. If seeing the second part of because maybe only getting 4 100s. Just so y'all know how crazy this score is, this is a 20 plus minute map with almost 8k combo and he only dropped 4 100s throughout the whole run. I think this is also the best act on the map as well. Okay, now onto the number 4 spot, which is Rafis' 9 miss run on Jashi no Konrei. This is another Another Imperial Circus map that recently got a bounty, believe it or not. The first FC in the map will get $100, and it has to be a Nomad FC, but it, of course it has to include a live play. Will Rafis manage to pull this off? Let me know down in the comments. Alright, now we go on to the number 3 spot and just so y'all know how big the difference is in the votes between the number 4 and 3 spot, number 4 spot had 57 votes while the number 3 spot had 80 votes. Looks like Chikoni's hidden DTFC on Asuno Yozora with 99.30% accuracy was just crazy enough to get the number 3 spot. The mouse legend had an absolute pop off this week this was one of the craziest scores that he managed to set, so take a look. Number 2 spot by just one vote, Lifelines is from Undercover, Hidden DTFC managed to make it. He got the number 1 spot on the map and it's worth 1166 pp. I mean you already know that this is a crazy score so I'm just going to show it to you. And finally, for this week, the number one score is Easy Champs DTFC on Made of Fire. For those of you that know the map, you already know that this is one of the most insane DTFCs you'll ever see. But if you don't, I think it's best to just show it to you to see how crazy it is. So yeah, just have a look.
Anyways, thank you for watching the first ever episode of Score Peak. Let me know if you want to see more episodes of a series like this. This is just a test episode to see if y'all like it or not. Also, if you haven't watched it, then be sure to watch the previous episode of Austin News. Some crazy stuff happened. And yeah, I'ma just go back to sleep, man. Bye-bye.